So the Ascot Stairs Cup is next. This is a two and a quarter mile listed race, and it'll be the Doncaster Cup over a similar distance in a week or two. Or two well, it might even be next week, to be honest. So some of these might be going there. Billy Otters at the top for Paul Rhodes, Archduke for Craig Beckwith, Champion of the Faithful, Leon Van Rensburg, Desert Hobo, Craig Beckwith, Minister of Justice, Paul Rhodes, Stella Buell for Satyam, Dia Shana's sister, and Highbury Ladybird for Graham Clutterbuck, Infinite Prospect for David Robertson, and Tampa Bay General for Vinnie Gerrard. So, all installed, we're raining again, and away we go. A little bit slow out was Stella Bjorn, that's not normal for a Satyam, but it's made up for that already, and he's now pushing to try and take the lead, but it looks like Tampa Bay General might have beaten him too, it's going to get across to the rail, but the Satyam wants have just got enough speed to stop it from being able to cut across, and so has got the rail now then, so it's... Tampa Bay General on the outside of Stella Bjorn. Those two are clear of Minister of Justice, who's back in third ahead of stablemate Billy Idle. Then comes Dia Shana's sister down on this near side with stable companion Highbury Ladybird. Arch Duke is also well placed early on. Craig Beckwith's got two as well. Quite a few trainers got two in this. And towards the back, Infinite Prospect is just a back marker for David Robertson, and he's got just a one. As has Vinnie Gerard, who's got the leader, Tampa Bay General. They come past the big stand, then past the winning post circuit to go in this Ascot Stayers Cup listed race. And Tampa Bay General in front from Stella Bjorn in second. Satyam does well in the handicap, so he can step up and take a listed race. We'll soon see. Then comes Minister of Justice and Billy Idol, second and third. After that one, Champion of the Faithful with Archduke on its outside. And then the Clutterbuck pair. Dia Shana sister on the outside of the grey Highland Ladybird and then comes Desert Hobo and finally Infinite Prospect just the back marker Tampa Bay General definitely won the battle to lead over Stella Bjorn who's back in second and Minister of Justice and Billy Idol Archduke and Champion of the Faithful Highbury Ladybird and Dia Shana sister Infinite Prospect and finally Desert Hobo Make their way down the back straight, then past the trees, race down towards Swinley Bottom, and then swing into the straight. And Tampa Bay General will be hoping to lead all the way through that with Stella Bjorn in second, then Billy Idol and Minister of Justice. Then after that comes Champion of the Faithful and Archduke, then Highbury, Ladybird, and Dia Shana Sister with Infinite Prospect trying to go around the outside. Desert Hobo looks like he's going to try and wait for a split up the inside. Inside the final mile now, and Tampa Bay General is two and a half clear of oh, Stella Bjorn, who's now being pressed by Billy Idol the second. Minister of Justice is fourth, then comes Champion of the Faithful Archduke is next. The Graham Clutterbuck pair is still matching strides, neither of them made a move yet. Both well fancied in the market. And Tampa Bay General is about to be joined by the Rhodes pair, Minister of Justice and Billy Idol. Stella Bjorn just hit a bit of a flat spot. Champion of the Faithful now being pushed along to join that leading four of these. Are oh, now two or three lengths clear of the rest of them. Headed by Archduke, Daisha and her sister. And Highbury Ladybird are going to have to get going soon. And the one that already has started to get going is Infinite Prospect as they start to go into the final four, four furlongs. And Tampa Bay General is in the lead. But look at this Champion of the Faithful swooping around the outside. Also coming with a run is Infinite Prospect. Suddenly the Paul Rhodes horses are starting to look one pace. The Highbury Ladybird is trying to get up the inside, Daisha and her sister switch to the outside, but it's Tampa Bay General in the lead, then two and a half furlongs to go Tampa Bay General now being cornered by Champion of the Faithful, Infinite Prospect is ready to close there, four lengths clear of the rest of them, who are headed by the Clutterbuck pair, but it's Champion of the Faithful in the lead Champion of the Faithful that is in front by three quarters of an end, Infinite Prospect on the outside, Tampa Bay General looks beaten they race down towards the final furlong and it's Champion of the Faithful who's suddenly gone too clear, Harmony Ladybird's now getting into overdrive, so too is Daisha and sister but they may have left it too late because champion of the faithful has slipped the field and champion of the faithful is going to take it from a very fast finish in Highbury Lady but then Dia Shana sister and Tampa Bay General Archduke after that one and all the way back to Stella Bjorn and Will Graham Clutterbuck be having a serious word with his jockeys because they left their runs a little bit too late didn't they they were eating up the ground they couldn't get to the favourite champion of the faithful who takes it for Leon van Rensburg. Highbury Ladybird second 
for Graham Clitterbrook, who also had Di Shana's sister in third. Tampa Bay General, the long-time leader for Vinnie Gerrard, was fourth. And Art Duke for Craig Beckwith was fifth. <laughs> 